Hi, I'm Jeff Herring. I'm at Fight Light Industries here at the uh, 2017 NRA Annual Meetings in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, we uh, um, Guns.com and we're here to talk about our, our Fight Light Industries SCR. The SCR is a sport configurable rifle. Uh, we sell this in pretty much all 50 states. Um, this rifle is a traditional platform, but what's nice about it is it uses standard AR-15 style upper receiver groups, which means you have the flexibility uh, of uh, modularity of an AR-15, but on a really traditional kind of platform. Um, the uh, SCR started out, we started the development on it in 2003. Uh, I was sitting in my office one day and looked down on the floor, I had an 870 shotgun, and at that time the federal assault weapon ban was such that um, we didn't really think that would ever sunset. And um, I was looking at that shotgun and I thought, you know, I wonder if we could put an AR-15 top end on it. And, and as it worked out, um, laid one down on top of the receiver. And I said, you know, I think we can do this. So we started working on it as an engineering effort internally. And of course, that, that law did sunset. But as we worked on the various prototypes, we realized that it had much longer legs than just being an assault weapon workaround. And, and we were right. As people would pick up the gun and handle it, they said, you know what, this thing uh, really points very quickly. Uh, it's right on target. It's lightweight, 5.7 pounds. And it's so modular that you can change calibers, upper receivers, barrels, pretty much almost anything you can do on an AR, which of course is America's favorite rifle, you can do on an SCR. Um, I'll show you real quick, Ben, how this top end comes off. It's just like an AR in that you push two captive pins and you can take the top end group off just like that. The way it works is there's an articulating strut on the back of a shortened bolt carrier. But if you look, it's a standard quarter inch two pin takedown. The only thing that's different is when you reassemble, unlike an AR-15 where you pivot the action together, you push both pins out and you slide this down, cycle the action and you're back in, back in action. So as we started selling these, we introduced this at NRA 2014 and um, had a very good response to it. One thing that happened last year was California enacted new laws um, that uh, created new AR or correction uh, assault weapon laws in the state of California and our rifle I guess they realized it's a sporting rifle and they they went right on through with with no uh, restrictions whatsoever this model here has a key mod handguard and it's still California legal 100% no bullet buttons required it still a, maintains its detachable magazine of course, this model has a threaded barrel, which is fine in California. But really just a, a really nice, lightweight, quick pointing, fun rifle. Where can we find it? Well, well, you know, we sell this through two-step distribution. We sell complete rifles and we also sell lower receiver assemblies. So some of our favorite distributors who carry this product, uh, Brownells of course carries lower receiver assemblies primarily. We also sell it through Amchar Wholesale, through AccuSport, through RSR Group, uh, Midwest Gunworks. Uh, we have a lot of people that carry this product. Uh, we understand that Big Five Sporting Goods may be getting them out in California also. Turner's Outdoorsman may carry them. Uh, Chattanooga Shooting Supplies, I think, is starting to book them in. Uh, the uh, lowers typically are around $599 for a lower receiver assembly at retail. And uh, the rifles start about $1,300 with the key mod as I'm holding right here.